past 30 years, I have been visiting this little Benedictine monastery out in north of Santa Fe, a little area called Abiquiu, New Mexico. And they do what St. Benedict asked, that they would pray and that they would work. And so part of their prayer is attending, praying, what we call the Liturgy of the Hours, seven times a day. Sometimes the hour is a true 60 minutes, sometimes it's a half an hour, and then there's what we call little hours, like the terse, and it's just maybe five minutes or nine minutes. And at the terse, at this Benedictine monastery, every, every morning after breakfast, they pray, Lord God, set my heart aflame for love of you. The very first commandment, Jesus says, is the most important. And then the prayer says, and through the day, may those I meet be set aflame because of my love. There it is, praying every day for what Jesus says is the most important, to love God, to love our neighbor, to be set on fire for our love of God so that we may set others on fire for the love of one another. What a great thing to ask ourselves, we call it examine our lives each day. Have I been loving? Have I set someone on fire because of my love? And the saints warn us that to love isn't just that warm, fuzzy feeling because sometimes, sometimes for days, sometimes for weeks, sometimes for years, we have no sense of love, no feel for love. But does that excuse us from not loving God or loving our neighbor, absolutely not, because the saints will tell us love is not a feeling, but it is an action, it is a decision, it is the way we choose to live our lives. And so may we pray like those monks each day, Lord, set my heart aflame for love of you, that those I meet today will be set on fire because of my love for them. Today, Jesus reminds us as he is challenged, what is the greatest commandment? May we grow in our love of God and may we grow in our love for one another.